All right. Whoa! Suck it, Steve! I got waterworks! What do you got? Oh. Yeah! Here's your freaking money! So every good manager should have a plan. And my plan was to gain one of pretty much everything, every color. Even uh, one railway, uh, uh, one waterworks, but so far, uh, kind of hasn't been going as planned. Uh, I kind of gave away the waterworks to uh, Steve. He kind of, so to speak, pushed me into it. Um, and then I kind of gave away the other light blue because Dylan asked for it. And I didn't really get anything out of it. I, th I think I'm done being pushed around, and I'm definitely done with Steve pushing me around. I'm, I'm done being timid. I'm done being timid, Tim. Right. Oh, man. How much, what's the damage? Marvin, 1,200. Uh, okay, well. Um, I think I'm out. Are you sure? Yeah, I get, these are like 80 bucks to mortgage them. And I have like $500. Do you take credit? <sighs> Sorry. All right, I'm out. You win, Dylan? I should have planned ahead, but now I know for the future. I definitely think playing the game helped me. Watching the other managers and having to constantly re-strategize gave me a new perspective on management. <sighs> I can't believe this is the first time I lost, man. It's also the first time I got caught cheating, but I guess it's not gonna last. And I think that that guy from counting, that weasel is just onto me. There's no more cheating, it's not gonna work. So I'll see what else I can do from now. So I finally get what, why corporate sense is here. Um, playing with all the other managers, you kind of can really see everyone's characteristics and kind of broaden your horizons on your management tactics. Um, like when I caught Steve cheating, I kind of suspected he was cheating before I called him out. Um, so if this was my office and I knew someone was cheating and I didn't call him out, it could have affected the other employees. So I think in the office I need to be sterner and kind of put my foot down like how I did with Steve. So after the game, I kind of realized managing isn't really my thing. Um, I might get into something like beekeeping or maybe botany, something gentle, something where assholes like Steve can't push me around. I think I'm gonna quit. <laughs>